It's 42 Tomoka Meadow. This has a new roof on it, but uh, you do have some wood rot area here, which I don't know why they didn't fix when they uh, did the roof. But that would need some attention there, not uh, too major. You come in, um, do need some updating, but you've got tile floor, it's pretty good shape. First half bath here. Um, cabinets are kind of dated, but in good shape. If you're going to use it as a rental, I'd probably just leave those. Throughout, you'll see a lot of the dark wood trim. I would definitely recommend getting rid of that, uh, either painting it white, and then a lot of the bifold doors are broken and whatnot. So you probably want to do new bifold doors and new doors uh, in this unit to, uh, to make it ready. And some wall patches, some carpet, whatnot, you'd be pretty good to go. Off to the right here, you've got the kitchen. Looks like the original cabinets. Once again, they're in pretty good shape, so probably just leave those. I'll get rid of this wallpaper back here. It's peeling off. Fridge looks kind of rough, rusted there. Might want to get any one of those. Carpet's not too bad, but I would definitely replace it. All the wallpaper in here, I would definitely do some work and remove that. Washer dryer here, this little utility closet here. Then the uh, living room area. Good amount of space. What's neat about this unit is that it backs up to a buffer here. So you just have woods behind you. You have some cracking in the deck here. And this little storage shed that's built out here is kind of rotten. So uh, we want to give that some attention. But you can see out, out the back, it's real nice. You're not looking at any other buildings. You just look out into the uh, the woods here, which is kind of a nice feature. Outside AC compressor. You can see down here, got some more uh, some wood rot. Want to uh, pay some attention to that. But up higher, everything else looks pretty good. Don't see anything jumping out at me there. Once again, you got the, the same rot back there. few wall patches here and there, but overall walls are in pretty good shape. The wallpaper would be the uh, largest thing to tackle. This is a two bedroom, two bath. It's set up basically as two masters, which is a nice feature. Right at the top of the hall, you have a little closet here. Decent amount of space there. Bedroom number one, you see you got some broken bifolds. But like I said, I'd probably recommend just going ahead and replacing all the bifolds and the entry doors. A lot of them are uh, broken, messed up. Good sized bedroom, a few wall patches. It's nice about this one, you got multiple closets, a lot of storage, which is great for a townhome property. Looks like original cabinets in here, once again, kind of dated, but still in decent shape. Probably just leave those. More closet space. Shower here looks like with a good cleaning would be fine. Probably would want to take this wallpaper down, paint all the trim white. Bedroom number two here. This one has two closets. Bathroom here has tile in here. Cabinets, uh, same as everywhere else, still in good shape. Tub shower, looks in good shape. You can see up here where it looks like there was uh, some leak issues. Most likely that was before they did the roof. And I uh, definitely would want to get rid of the wallpaper in this bathroom. And then there's your uh, closet number two, which is also tiled, which is nice. So this concludes the tour. This is Jay Byron Abair with Adams Cameron & Company Realtors. 321-296-8000. 321-296-8000.